Malaysia produces 39% of the world's oil palm and 44% of world exports. The palm oil industry employs almost half a million workers in Malaysia, with 80% of them being migrants mostly from Indonesia, India, Nepal, and Bangladesh. Migrant workers may be at risk of human rights violations, abuses and exploitation at different stages of their migration journey, starting from the recruitment in countries of origin to employment in Malaysia and up to their return. I came to Malaysia hoping for a better life and to have my family back home. But, I was sent to a remote location and felt isolated and lonely. It's hard to talk about my feelings with my friends, because they might see me as weak and not manly if I tell them about how lonely being here is, and how I miss going out freely. I paid a huge amount of money to get a job in a garment industry in Malaysia. Instead, I was sent to this plantation. I have to work in a palm oil plantation where my salary is based on how many fruits I can collect. It will take me years to pay back what I paid for this job. I wasn't given a contract or a receipt for the money I paid to get this job. When I got to Malaysia, I have difficulties with access to food, clean water, and medical care. My supervisor at work was verbally and physically abusive. I didn't feel safe to make a complaint. These are just few of the stories of the many migrant workers who face exploitation and abuse in the palm oil industry in Malaysia. It's time for all stakeholders to work together to ensure sustainable change and end forced labor. A new report from the International Organization for Migration IOM, highlights the challenges faced by migrant workers in Malaysia through five fictional stories based on interviews with 136 migrant workers in oil palm plantations. To read more about the experiences of Akash and other workers, you can download the publication at roasiapacific.iom.int.